Hey there, Survivors, it's Razius Gaming, bringing you some more uh, reviews and discussions regarding the new update, which just dropped down today, which was 235. Just wanted to give a brief overview of the Terror Bird, as you can see here, and in my follow-up video here, I will go, go out and tame one as well, show the grappling hook and some of the other features of the game. So let's just go over the dossier a little I did do it in the in-game last time, but this time I'm just doing it this way since it's right before the drop. And so let's begin. We have the common name, which is Terrorbird. Its species is the Furusinicidae Rapacitol Rapide Solter, uh, which is late Pelicine period diet is it is a carnivore with a very aggressive temperament from what I'm told it is very large and kind of acts like an ostrich with speed and power so that is kind of interesting um, the terror raptor shows that interesting traits related to theropods such as Utah raptors carnivores and tyrannosaurus it has many similar traits such as generals uh, shape and predation patterns but it attacks 10 towards lightning dashes and leaping slashes ranging from 8 to 12 feet tall the terror raptor is a highly aggressive avian that is just barely capable of very brief flight instead it uses its wings primarily for balance during its high speed sprints the terror bird's flight is actually closer to an impressive sustained leap or glide that is assisted with lengthened by flapping of its wings if you manage to tame this terror bird, it is an excellent combat mount, particularly for harassing and scouting. Riders of the terror bird gain most of the benefits of a fast, mobile ground-based theropod, while also gaining the freedom of movement from the, a flyer. Assuming that the rider can coax the terror bird into staying into the air over a long leap. So, looks like it has a few problems with its stamina as far as flight goes, but it's very fast, very strong. Uh, from what I'm told, it also attacks very fast. I haven't personally seen most of this yet. I still have to go out and tame one myself since the patch just released very recently. But based on the video, um, it seems very primitive in a sense, but it seems kind of cute and interesting at the same time from my perspective. Um, Looks like it'll do better in pack mentality, but I don't know necessarily if that pack mentality is existent in this species. But being able to potentially outrun a Rex, considering the end of that video with them flying off the cliff, they would first have to outrun it to actually get away. So I'm assuming it is very, very fast on its feet for the sprinting portion of it. And then the flight did seem kind of puny, so we'll see how that goes when I actually tame one. But... With that, I did like the video. The grappling hook seemed very interesting. <laughs> it was kind of funny with the turn on that, so I don't know how that's going to go. I, um, From what I'm told, it actually is an attachment to a crossbow, so it's not its own item. And the actual bow can cost considerable amount, but we'll do that in a follow-up video as well. Um, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you subscribe you can see some more wonderful content and i will see you guys next time have a wonderful day